my channel. Today is freaking Saturday and it feels fantastic. Loving life like always. I hope you guys are too. As long as you keep that evil out of your life, man, everything will be great. Today we're gonna do an unboxing of some shit that I got in the mail today. So I hope everything's good. I hope you guys enjoyed my last video. Consultainment Center is going well, as you can tell. There's already three slots in there. So you guys will be seeing the fourth one soon. It's just taking a while because of the schedule stuff and you know, work. <laughs> Life, family, good stuff like that. All right, let me show you what I got. Ain't much, because not much stuff I got came in. Some of the Amazon stuff I've been picking up with promo codes has been taking a little bit longer. Right, here you go. Not much. Uh, I got a new shirt that actually came from uh, TJ Maxx Marshalls or something like that. And I got a couple packages here. Not much. For now, hopefully next week's uh, unboxing will be better once I get everything in. So let's start ripping this bitch up. I want to start off by telling you guys this new watch that I picked up. This thing is so Check this out, man. This thing is so rad. I guess it's like, I don't know, some new company in China probably, but or Russian. I think it's something like that. I opened this up because I was extremely excited about it, and also my expectations were very low. Because I'm not much of a watch guy, but... So, what I did is I, I just, I couldn't help it. I just opened it up, and I wanted to show my wife, because my wife is a huge, like, watch, smartwatch fan. I'm telling you, man, this thing is just, like, incredible. I've had this watch now for, like, two weeks, and it's on the same freaking battery that it came in the box with. I haven't even charged it yet. I mean the screen is just beautiful on this thing. It's so good I, I picked this up with a promo code. Uh, it cost me like 40 bucks And what I needed is I just needed something so I could listen to uh, music at work and change it on the fly I mean look at the way this thing looks on the wrist. It just looks so dope It doesn't it looks like literally a tough-ass watch like somebody in the Secret Service would have I just can't even begin to explain like how this thing is, this is so freaking rad So let's start off with the shirt that I got my daughter and my wife picked this up for me Marshalls as you can see it's Calvin Klein they paid $13 for this now the manufacturing retail price suggested retail price is 40 which is ridiculous so let's start off with the one that I know what this is just because I can tell by the size plus it says the name on top of it where it's from oh. I, I buy this hair stuff like all the time so every month I gotta buy one I go through so much of it the fresh seal so you know nobody licked it take note all right so let's see what the hell this is Hopefully it's not a sex toy. What the hell is it? Oh shit, I got duped. These were supposed to be for knobs. Uh, is the shaft for the, the knobs, which I thought was the knobs. I probably should have read the whole description rather than just knob That's and bullshit. the picture. So now I gotta have to return these. Woo! All right, this next one here. Uh, it came in a pack, but there was something in it for my wife or my daughter, so I just opened it and gave it to them, but this came in. Alright, so what this is, most of you retro gamers out there are gonna know. Battery, coin holder, a through hole part. The old fashioned consoles, the retro consoles, they all come with like this, this uh, battery in there that, sh that literally has like no juice left. So if a lot of you who own Dreamcast will know that when you turn on your Dreamcast, you always have to put the date in. The battery's dead. And most of those batteries are actually soldered in. You solder this into its place and the layout's pretty much the same. Drop another coin battery in here instead of always unsolder soldering it every like five or ten years so I know I'm gonna have to change the one on my Saturn because my Saturn is I've had that thing I was probably 18 when I bought that thing at a flea market so I know that one I'm gonna have to change the original Xbox that one's gonna be just a matter of time especially when I open it up to add the mod chip I'm just gonna end up taking it out and just adding one of these and dropping the coin in there so these were five bucks because I was looking at you know buying five and too many sellers were selling only five for five dollars 25 actually it was 25 for five dollars you know I'm rather I might as well just buy it and just keep it you know what I mean if I eventually have to fix somebody's Dreamcast or something or another console I can always just do that all right let's start for the next one Ooh, this one's special oh, this upside down oh, it's a hyperkin product it's a TurboGrafx-16 controller with a 10-foot cord, bitch. The reason I picked this up is because my controller is actually busted. I really like the fact that it came with 10-foot uh, wire on the controller. And I really like the fact that it was, um, I was hyperkin. So I know I'm getting a product that's going to have, like, quality built into it. It has all those, like, rapid-fire buttons in here and everything, just like the original does. 
So I'll show you guys what happened to my original one since the damn thing was busted. Let me show you guys my controller. It's exactly what it should be. Ugly, dirty, scratches. You can tell somebody play the shit out of this controller because it's all worn out over here. And then here's the problem with my controller, right? This connector here is broken. I plugged this thing in right to my console and the freaking connector was left inside the console. That's for you to see how bad this is. This is not the first time this has happened to me. Let's get the next one, son. This one I bought. They didn't cover the damn picture with the label. I can show you guys. So this is actually a monitor riser for my laptop because I want to be able to put like my mouse underneath it so when I'm doing something I can just go like I have this one from Radio Shack a long long time ago and it's already served its purpose I just I, I don't want it anymore I really just want to move on to something else I don't really want it last but not least my favorite one that I know is what it is this this I think it does is awesome I waited three and a half weeks for this one oh. My precious. This is a modified SD card, my Neo Geo X. So you guys have already seen that me unbox that. That was like my newest console I got since I got the Switch. <gasps> oh my god. Dude, it came with a whole bunch of games already. Look! It came with an SD card in it. Look! So that means they already put the games on it. Oh my god. Dude, that is amazing. Dude, I didn't know it was gonna come with the freaking games. So this is a modified SD card. What it is, is it's got the pins crossed on this side and this side. Now what I was gonna do is I bought some extenders and I was going to extend it, you know, and flip the cables over so it would be the same thing as this. But this was $24. Yeah, $24, that includes taxes and free shipping from China. Um, and AliExpress was charging the same thing, so I figured I'd just stick to the eBay since I, I trust eBay a lot. Yeah, that's what this is. And you put this in the Neo Geo X and you can play ROMs and you're all set, man. All right, so um, I'm gonna try this out. I'll make a video of it, let you guys know how it turns out. I'm super excited that it came with an SD card. That just means there's games on it. So now I'm gonna see if it works and how good it works. All right, so I, I'll see you guys on the next one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you haven't already and thank you to my new subscribers. I'll see you guys on the next one. Don't forget to love life, son. Peace. I am a prodigy. I am a leader. They follow me.